In the country districts in Trinidad, particularly in a bygone day, the larger bliss was very prominent. She was supposed to be a beautiful lady, well-dressed, and she would enter into a room or any scene where there are men, and men would fall for her, and they would pursue her. The right foot is a human foot. The left foot is an animal foot. You have a hoof made as an animal one. And when she walking on the road, you put the left foot in the grass and the right foot on the road. The larger bless, um, name suggesting devil, the devil woman. She has the traditional goat's cloven hoof, and that's a traditional way, again it's European, of representing the devil, but it's the devil in an alluring female form. Usually she appears to drunk men, strangely enough, wandering home at odd hours in the night. She lures them astray. When they look down at her feet or when they hear the sound of the hooves, uh, they realize they are trapped. Again, you see, you see the same mythology operating in, say, a play like Dr. Faustus, one of the people that Dr. Faustus wants. When he makes his deal with Mephistopheles, the figure, is um, he wants to have Helen of Troy. Now, Helen of Troy, of course, is already dead and gone, so the devil fixes up a woman or appears in female form because the result of that encounter is a, a loss of your soul. And maybe should question why it is this demon is supposed to appear in the alluring form of the, of, of the female. Whether the, the Europeans were expressing their fear of a female sexuality, for example, the notion that such sexuality was fundamentally evil. Usually, again, you have to think about tracks instead of roads, right? Gravel road instead of pitch road, no street lights, plenty bush, bamboo patches and stuff like that. She could be escorting this lady home. When she, when they reached way, way, because everything was so sweet, he wouldn't notice where they were going and all this kind of thing. He would get the urge to smoke a cigarette. And when he tried to light it, she would discourage him, no, 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 but apparently smoking had a value in that particular situation. Because if the guy went ahead and struck that match, he would suddenly disappear in a big flash. The Elijah Bless character ultimately evolves out of the West African goddess of love, Izuli. She's the ultimate feminine, womanly beauty. The goddess of love becomes easily, when the stories are told, of the goddess of vengeance. The large bless is, is the revenge of the woman that was wronged by men. The man who beats the woman, who treats her badly, who makes her become small and mean, he is the man, that is the man that experiences ultimately the larger blessing.